Korea. About almost nine o'clock, probably. The first set of animals that we've seen besides those elk. And blessed to be here, bro. So we're gonna get after it today and see if we can't find something worth killing. It's uh, first day of December, 2022, and uh, this year I, David Brosco does all my application stuff, and he uh, told me that the Hickory was a place I needed to start applying for if I wanted a chance at a giant deer, and I put in, and uh, first year I put in, I drew it. And I called David after I drew it and said, are you sure this is where I want to go hunt? And he said, absolutely. And so about a month ago, um, I had the thought that uh, it's just I had a thought like you need to call grandpa and get grandpa on this hunt because this could be a special thing and my grandpa has been my best friend since I was little he's always been there for me and to have him here and to I mean the deer's great like deer of a lifetime but to have my grandpa here something I'll never forget so I'm grateful to be here but I'm just grateful for my grandpa and I love him and uh, man this is gonna be a tough trip tough trip to beat so Brian thank you man I appreciate you you've been nothing but fantastic to us and uh, the Hickory is an amazing place um, you can't beat this this is unbelievable so one of the most exciting days of my life that I've ever had in the outdoors because my grandpa's here with me, so. Good work, Grandpa. These are the neatest young men I've ever seen. Have them, have them come to my home sometime and stay. <laughs> glad he will. Well, you're always welcome. That's something special right there. Well, I'm glad you were able to make it too. Can you imagine how many 83-year-old like men sitting home in front of the TV? Just saying, yes, dear, yes, dear, yes, dear. <laughs> My hands do not touch. <laughs> Thank you. 
See that big red colored tree? Yep. Right up. Go up straight up. Oh, up. okay. We're getting ready to go down. I spotted this deer about 10 minutes ago. He bedded down and we're getting ready to get up a little bit closer and see if we can get a better look at him. So day two of the Hickory. Getting after it. A little windy today. So we're gonna see if we can get a little closer and check this one out. Get the gun just in case. See that doe popped out to the right? I just wanna make sure we don't bust him out of there. I think they might be. Do what? That's it. You see a little trash on him? I can't tell. I'd say, I thought I saw a little bit of trash on him, so. That might be the buck we're looking for. It might be. I just, there's another doe we seem to be careful. I don't know, because there might be several with them that we can't see bedded on this side. You stand up. Stop it's only day two, man. It's hard for me to. No, but it's still hard for me to shoot him because it's only day two at the Hickory. <laughs> you know, man, it's getting better every day. Yeah, it's. Call is crazy, but I think we're passing. It's the perfect typical. Oh, oh yeah. You know, like nice big backs. We know he's in here. We know he's in here. 28 inside. Yeah, there he is. Yeah. yeah. There he is. Look at him right there. God. <laughs> and I gotta get, I get my partner to the Super Bowl. Yeah, we got <laughs> standards here, you know. What are the standards? Standards is two ten. <laughs> two ten. Super Bowl tickets. Super Bowl tickets. We got eight and a half more days. Wow. It's hard to pass on a deer like that, but we are here. Yeah, we are here. You know, this is probably my only chance to ever come here. If, if we don't see a bigger one than this one, then that's my, my call. <laughs> yeah. God, that's a big yeah. deer. You can't, kill two, you can't kill a 210 if you're shooting at 190s. Yep. That's just the deal. I have a feeling. We got a lot more eyes on the ground too, <laughs> and we're still looking. Oh yeah. So odds are in our favor. Odds are getting better every day. Get a little dust in the snow, then we can really pick them out. Oh yeah. Man, we're getting closer. Hopefully we draw this tag in two more years. We're gonna come right back to this spot. <laughs> He's just sitting right here at 150 yards. Yeah. Jason does Jason not giving a damn. Mm, heavy G4 splits. Man, if he puts on, he's already what, 190? Yeah. He'll probably put on another G4. Think about that. <laughs> Let's do it. 
said, get your fucking ass here. And I <coughs> dropped my key. Where are my keys? Let's go. Let's go. We're in the danger zone now. Yeah. We've had a good morning. Let's finish this bitch off. <laughs> then we're going to Vegas. Yeah. <laughs> in the forest. In the forest here. I love this running and gunning shit. Oh, yeah. Pays the have extra eyes. Come on, load up the pin. Oh, there we go. Yes. All right, man. So we just got a call from Chile and Brady. They've been up here looking, and we've been up searching. Bucks been on their feet all day, man. So they said they found a big deer, and we're like two and a half miles away. So we're hauling ass, see if we can get on this deer, and. And rock and roll, man. Stay Running and gunning, man. Big career style. Now. Let's go. Got him. He said, big? Hundo Plus. Okay. He said, Big frame and. This deer's got a great big inline got, off one side. He got it. Oh, this, no, no, that's, that's not, not him. him. No, he's, he's just, just he's beyond the 300 road. yards oh. this way. He's got a big ass frame and he's got extras. And an inline. And the yeah. wife said he's got an inline. This is that's we found him. We're, we're gonna go back on top of the small free Dude, His body is giant. Oh, I'll keep you updated, honey. Okay, all right, well let's do this. Okay, bye. Okay, thanks. Women, <laughs> trust them. that little clip and I dropped off to those big round rocks. Try to... Just right here. See these? So that you see this clip? flat top, it drops off. There's those two big rocks on the bottom. Yeah. This side of it, right here, it's a little same. Is he this side? Yeah. He's on this side. Do you see I see those two rocks. Those two rocks come down into the left. Down to the left. He's, he's at those round rocks. He's where by the rock? He's, he's toward us about 100 yards. So I got, I'm trying to figure out which rocks that you're looking at. See this, this uh, dime field yeah. goes straight up. Okay. And you'll see him as you're going up. Okay. Man, he sure, he's, he's got a cool shape to him though. How he kind of flares out. Lays out nice. Yeah. I did not see this deer. Uh, he's about to he's about to walk onto the road. Yeah, he's way right. Now.
<laughs> He's like three ten. Honolulu area, the Hickoria. Yesterday we had two coyotes, one actually right here, and I missed them, which I miss. And you know, it's like, okay. Well, I ended up, we went to another area, another coyote, I missed. And that's not right to miss two in a day. So we shot the gun, gun was off, um, very bad. We shot a full box of bullets and we come to realization now that the, we had a bad box of bullets. So we luckily we had an extra box of bullets. We're out back out here at the same spot and uh, we've just shot, got the gun dialed in at hundred yards. And now we're about to shoot at 350. That's center an inch high. And up a box and a half. Uh, shoot one more time, make sure that we're all dialed in, the turret's correct, the gun's working properly and be able to give hopefully a 220 inch mule deer a uh, proper um, death vessel. So that's what we're going to be working on here. One more shot, then we're going to be hitting the truck and rolling again. So, ADS.
Struggled the last couple of days. Been kind of warm, um, but the weather's kind of changing a little bit. Got a little dust in the snow last night. We're in a different area this morning. And we just right off the bat, bucks are pushing does. So hopefully today we can have a good day, see a lot of deer, and uh, we're just gonna be patient, take our time, and try to try to glass up a giant. So we're gonna get after it. The boys are working hard, and uh, yeah, man, Hickory 2022, sir.
I don't even know what day it is. I think it's day eight. We've been putting like 300 miles a day on the truck, just all around the reservation looking and looking and looking. So it's the coldest morning we've had. We got dust and snow last night. We're in the area. So now it's just putting eyes behind the glass, getting after it today until the end. So hopefully we turn one up and, and give it a go. Day eight, Hickory 2022. Day eight, man. We finally found the deer we've been looking for for this day two. Yeah. Six days. Six days. We just caught him, caught him just because of sunlight. And now we, uh, now we just got to study him a little bit. We got a couple days left. This might be our deer, depending. We uh, got a little discouraged. He's getting up. He's getting up. He's moving. A little discouraged. There's a been a mountain lion roaming these parts. Yeah, there has been. Good job. Good job. He down for sure. Keep eyes on him. He down. I saw him go belly up. Day eight. Day eight. This is unbelievable. We've been chasing this deer for since for six days. Man, we, could, we just caught him. Man, is a. That's the way you want to kill one. Not another. Not another truck on the cliff. Spot stalk. Spot, spot and stalk off a cliff. 280 yards. <laughs> That's awesome. That is awesome, boys. That was crazy. Whew. You know what? We've been we've been running around this country for what? How many miles we put on a day? Two fifty? Easy? Oh yeah. Easy. <coughs> and to finally pull him up, and we knew it. We're gonna get cold, a little snow. What did I tell you up there when I did my toast? Mm -hmm. He's gonna be at the end. Gonna be at the end. It's the biggest deer. The biggest deer we've seen all trip. Yeah. Biggest deer we've seen all trip. You guys haven't seen a We got some Weller 12 year to partake in, and I, hey, <laughs> what we talk about? We talked yeah. about a lunch party at the Skinny Skinny, baby. Woo! Oh, yeah! Randall. Good job, Chili. Thank you. That's what it's about, gentlemen. And friends for life, it. man. You found it. Uh, friends for life right there. We, we all found it. It was team effort. Team effort. Team effort, Dude, running and gunning and shit. When I ran over here, and I couldn't find him again. I started panic I was like, where is he, where is he, where is he? <laughs> Dude, I heard the truck. Was right there below me, a hundred yards, and I was like, oh, "Yeah, that's good. <laughs> heavy." Oh my god! Yeah, dude, that was that's the way I love to do it. Doesn't matter if you're 160 inches, 240 inches, the hunt and the whole deal and the glassing and the effort and run down the whole finger, run down mile and a half down the whole He's finger across the valley where he was first seen. Yeah, he was yeah, what? Yeah, where he was when we first saw. And that's for sure him, huh? That's for sure. I'm for sure him. That right side, you cannot mistake that side. That's him. Big old New Mexico deer right there. Quartering away.
Thanks, brother. Really. That's awesome. That is an awesome deer, guys. Look how tall he is. Oh, yeah. Oh, we got him, Chili. Sure did. Oh. <sighs> Way up on that point. Oh, man. Team effort. It was a team effort. Look at that dude right there, man.